I can't believe it. What am I going to do? I need this job. Sandra, I know this is hard for you. Hard? How am I going to tell my family? Robert, you know my father is in assisted living. How am I going to begin to tell him? <laughs> I'm sorry. But... Can I get you anything, Sandra? A uh, glass of water? Where am I going to find another job? I spent my entire career here. For what? What, what am I going to do? My kids are in college. I have the mortgage. Robert, isn't there anything you can do? The company is doing what it can to help. We've arranged for outplacement to help you through this transition. Oh, yeah, I, I work so hard. I have some information for you which explains the terms of your separation. We don't have to go through it now, but I would like for you to take it with you so that you can read it later. Uh, I'll have Gloria, Gloria from Human Resources, give you a call in a day or two to see if you have any questions. Uh, Barbara, your Lee Hecht Harrison consultant, wants to meet you as soon as we're done here. Uh, why don't you just sit here for a moment? I'll bring her in so that I can introduce you to her. I'm sorry I'm a little late. I was on a conference call with Amanda and Bev, and you know what that means. Sometimes when I'm talking with them, I wonder if we even work for the same company. Do you know they asked me... Alyssa, won't you please sit down? Oh, sure, sure, Robert. What's up? You look so serious. Well, it's just I'd like to get started with our meeting. Sure, I understand. The way your schedule has been lately, every minute counts. Alyssa, I'm sure you've heard some of the rumors going around about the possibility of personnel cuts because of the recent merger. The company has had to take a hard look at some of the current and future staffing requirements. As a result, the decision has been made to reduce staff. The purpose of our meeting here today is to let you know that your job is one of those being eliminated. What I would like to do is to go over the details of your separation, Alyssa, if that's okay with you. You know, Robert, most of the time I enjoy your sense of humor, but this kind of crosses the line. I'm not joking, Alyssa. I'm very serious. Your position has been eliminated. Come on, Robert. I thought there would be cutbacks because of the merger, but why would my job be eliminated? The new, improved company is going to need the systems I developed now more than ever. I can understand why you may not have been expecting this, Alyssa, but your job has been eliminated. Look, Robert, if it's a matter of me relocating, you know I'd be willing to do it. In fact, I just spoke with Lewis about this a couple of weeks ago. Does Lewis know about this? Relocating is not the issue. Well, maybe I should speak with him again. This decision has been approved at the very highest levels of this company, and as president, Lewis was, of course, included. Well, I think I will speak with Lewis again. You can certainly speak with him if you like, but I have to tell you that this decision has been made. What I would like to do with you now is, if it's okay with you, is to go over the terms of your separation. Hi, Robert. You wanted to see me? Yes, Sam. Come on in. This place is crazy today. I thought this was supposed to be our slow season. What's up, Robert? You look kind of serious. Is everything okay? Uh, fine. Please, Sam, have a seat. Let me uh, get right to the point. Uh, I know you've heard some rumors going around about the company. Unfortunately, as it turns out, one of those rumors is true. Uh, because of the recent merger, the company has had to take a hard look at current and future staffing requirements. As a result, the decision has been made to reduce staff. Uh, the purpose of our meeting here today is to let you know that your job is one of those being eliminated. Wait, wait a minute, Robert. What are you saying? What do you mean my job is being eliminated? What I'm saying, Sam, is that as a part of the staff reductions, your job is being eliminated. I can't believe I'm hearing this. After 10 years, you're just going to sit there and expect me to believe that you're firing me? After 10 years? 
I know this must be hard for you to believe, but your job is being eliminated as an overall reduction in force. I can't believe this is happening. I've worked hard for this company for 10 years. We've worked together for seven years, Robert? Sam, this has nothing to do with performance. Then explain to me why you're firing me. Why don't you fire Mike? If you want my opinion, he hasn't worked in years. You know, a lot of thought and time went into deciding which positions will stay and which positions will be eliminated. Uh, we've been unable to identify a new position for you, and the decision has been made to terminate your employment. So if you'll please, sit down, Sam. I'd like to give you some information to help you through this transition period. This is the package that the company is offering. I'd like to go over it with you if that's okay.